so in this video we are going to see that um, how can you change the general settings uh, in filmora wondershare filmora 9 so i am using filmora uh, wondershare film uh, filmora 9 version so uh, we, are, we are going to see that uh, how can you change the default folder how can you change the default timing and like uh, many many more things so for that let's see uh, first of all we need to go to file then go to preferences over here you can see you have five different options like general like is the language like is the updates and if you don't want to show the updates you can click on this also the second thing is is that the folder so in which like uh, in which folder you want to sh you want to save all the recorded files audio uploaded files so you in which uh, folder in which drive you want to save so my suggestion is that you can uh, it's better to change this uh, from c drive because your c drive usually gets filled if you use all if you if you use the c drive which is having like your operating system so it's better to change this the temporary files are um, it's it's like it's not required to change because uh, it can you can delete that temporary file second thing uh, the recorded files you need to change that so it's documents like C drive in documents I will change to a different drive which is having like um, all my stuff so I'll go to YouTube videos over here I will make a new folder And what it says like it's a recorded files so it's wonderser filmora 9 recorded so let's rename this and make it like a um, filmora 9 and then over here I want to record it so create a recorded a folder and double click and select folder so now it's change to K Filmora 9 recorded again change the audio file also so again I just go to like wherever you want you can go there and um, make a new folder there it says that um, voice over voice over so voice over and after that you need to go inside the folder and then select the folder so that has that is the important step you need to follow uploaded files again uh, it's better to go in the same folder where you make for uh, recorded files and recorded audio so it's uh, filmora 9 over here go to and write upload and then you need to go inside the folder and then select the folder okay now it's the effect so browse for effects also I will suggest uh, make uh, like in the same folder which you make go there new if you if you follow all these steps I am sure that you will save a lot of space from like a lot of space in the drive where your operating system is uh, installed uh, manage it's like data uh, no, so like if you already have the um, effects you can see over here but I don't have any effects in my uh, windows have filmora 9 so i can't see that so now then click on ok so now this has been saved let's go again check it ok now it's kkk k drive ok now go to editing over here you can see that default duration like what is the photo duration so you can change that if you want if you want that let's say um the photo will remain for 10 seconds or let's let's say it, it, it will remain for seven seconds so you can change the default duration transition duration you can also change if you want effect duration is five seconds you can change if you let's say uh, it's um 10 uh, seconds so let's make it 10 and then freeze duration let's make it yeah five seconds i think is fine for freeze then the photo placement you can change like fit crop to fit pan and zoom insert mode can see like split selected tracks only and insert split all tracks and insert then you can see save so this is like for backup so backup my project every one minute and you can change the backup folder also let's make it the same where we have um, changed to the new one so it's in the, over here 
it says backup make a new folder for backup I am sure if you follow this step it will save a lot of space from your C drive like generally C generally the operating system drive is C drive so you, you will save a lot of space lot of memory from your from the win, uh, operating system drive okay again so let's go over this and make it project and then again you need to go inside of the folder and select that okay now performance you can change like uh, what um, graphic card you want what graphics you want to operate like to for the GPU acceleration then the background render you can change preview render folder you can change like it's a render I will change this to again in the the newest folder which I made and it says that render so just go over make a new folder for render and then go inside the folder and select that folder automatically rate under finds when closing a project no so if it's uh, we don't it's a clean remove all the render files if you want you can click that proxy automatically create proxies when media resolution is higher than i don't want that now the proxy location you can change if you want but if you're not selected then it's fine so let's go over here it says uh, proxy folder so make a new folder of proxy and then go inside and select that folder okay and now you can if you want to check you can just cross check all of all, all the things and if it's fine click on ok and now let's again just cross check it whatever we have done is fine or not so k drive yes it's changed from c to k like from operating system to different drive okay so now it's fine so in this way you can um change the drives the default drives uh, which is like generally operating system drive so that uh, whenever you uh, run a project in filmora 9 your the drive which is having operating system will not get full like it's not get um, like this project will not occupy the space from your operating system drive so operating system drive has to be uh, uh, like has to be low uh, like has to be more space it has it has to be more space and uh, so that your operating system will work really fine so that's all for this video if you like the video if this video is help, helpful to you in any ways hit the like button and subscribe my channel wiseman for for more such videos thank you